Hey guys, Mini Meerkat here, and today I am going to be looking at this Lego set, the Hulkbuster one from um, Infinity War, Avengers Infinity War. So, yeah, so I got the set yesterday, yes, yesterday. Anyway, so I thought it would be a good idea to show you guys what the set is, uh, in case you wanted to buy it or something. So, yeah, so we'll, we'll start off with a couple figures. So first, we got this one, who's in focus. It's a pretty cool figure, honestly. Uh, it's quite a powerful one in the movie, so yeah, she's got blue hair, uh, one gold arm and stuff. Her weapon looks pretty cool. So yeah, that's the, that's the first figure. Then we got Falcon, he's got his wings. The wings are a small build and they're just attached by a little piece on his neck. It's pretty cool. Right, so those two figures. Now we do have an Outrider. Uh, they're very common actually, this one had four arms. Well, six basically, but yeah. Four arms on the back, just connected by a little thing that goes onto the neck. And next, in the Hulk Buster, we have Bruce Banner. Bruce has two faces, an angry one as well. And also, she has two faces, smiling. And so does Falcon, who has a face without goggles and is smiling. Right, so, oh, so yeah, so there's the figures. Anyway, let's look at the simple turret thing. Right, so the turret has a little launcher where you squeeze it hard, like really hard, and then shoots out this Lego ball. Uh, it's got a couple stickers on here, there's like three stickers. And in the back, in the compartment, there is a soul stone. So this set comes with Soul Stone. Also, it has a little action feature where let's say you use the Hulk button to disable it and knock it, it goes, how, like that? <laughs> not like that. That is not how it goes. Um, let me just fix that a sec. It's quite a simple build. Right, there we go. It's quite a simple build. So you knock it down and then you connect it again, and then you can knock it down. So, very easy. That's the first time I broke it, though. <laughs> right, so I've got that. So, I, I like to put the Outrider on there, like he's controlling it. Right, so there's the turret, and then the figures. Right, and then we got the Hulk Buster, who has a uh, Bruce Banner in it. I want to change his face back, so... Right, uh, there we go. Back to his thing, small. Right, so basically, if you see in there, there's a little place where you sit in between their legs. So he just stands in there, like so. And then you just fold that up, fold the sides together, and then you just put the helmet down. And there we go. And this one has a little back bit here, and you twist it and it turns this on up and down up and down pretty cool play feature this has two four six eight nine stickers i think so quite a lot of stickers on this one and the fingers they can move up and down and stuff it has three fingers and then a thumb as well um and it's got some little shoulder pads but i find those break off kind of easily anyway uh yeah and the toes move like individually as well, like you can move the toes and it balances very well, like you can set it in like a really cool motion. See see about the shoulder pads? I think they, they fall off a lot, so yeah, let's see any negative about this set, but apart from that. So you can pose it really well actually and it just doesn't fall over. It's, it's really good, the toes help balance it a lot. So like, yeah, so that's really cool, I, I think. 
and then the legs will move separately. Right, so that one moves like that, doesn't it? So this one you can just move yourself and press, like, just put it however you want. So, yeah, and also with the, it has like ankles that can move around and stuff. Which is uh, pretty cool, is it? It's a really good build, I think. Um, there you can see the little cogs. And you can also fit the infinity stone in. Like, let's say you're playing in, like, may Bruce steal the, the soul stone. So, you, I mean, you can add this. I'll, I'll, I'll put all the stands on. So there's the soul stone there, right? What you can do is you can put it in, like, the cog bit. It, there's a little gap where you can put it in and then you can just put Bruce there and then it just stays in there fine you can hear it but like it's it's inside and it can't come out unless like you open it up but yeah so that's really cool I think um yeah it's a, a really good build uh hook uh oh guy <laughs> falcon I think it's really cool his, his wings have got four stickers on and he's just such a simple build which is only a few bricks on each wing it's like three about seven eight bricks on each wing and then the middle part but yeah that's it i i think it's really cool and same with the this one i forgot her name but She's really powerful, like she would pretend like you know, attack Hulkbuster or something. And also with a Hulkbuster, I guess it's like, an, like you can do a smash or like a punch up and then this shoots, but <laughs> I'm not sure if I really want to shoot it. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but the, I, so let's say I'm going to do some more Lego sets. Uh, I got one coming like tomorrow so that's gonna be really cool so i'm gonna do all this like infinity wall set reviews i'm gonna get all of them and do them so this is my first one basically i got my second arriving tomorrow and then i need to save up my money for another one, the other ones and stuff so there's six total infinity wall sets each come with an infinity stone this one comes with a soul stone the orange one if you don't know that it's really cool and they're really tiny though like really tiny but they do come with three spares which is like a lot the spares for infinity stones but i i guess they're so small that you can lose them easily so yeah so i out of 10 i'm gonna rate the set probably eight and a half because it's really good i'm gonna admit but then the, the shoulder plates take it down a bit and then i don't know these these characters are fine they're fine it's just that the shoulders on here like come off easily and uh i, I guess the arms aren't the best. See, that just came off again. So that's probably why. And then with this, I don't really find anything wrong. I think it's all fine with this. Like, I mean, it's, it's good. So it's a really simple build. It's basically a little platform up and a couple of these Technic bricks, I think they're called. And then another like brick platform, and then you just like put it down and push the two sides in, and it like connects. Like the only thing stopping it from falling over is the two little studs there. They so just connect it again. It's really easy. So yeah, so that that's the Lego set, the Hulk Buster one for Infinity War. Um, the next one is going to be the little, like, it's skateboard on the Guardians of the Galaxy ship. It comes with Rocket, Thor, and Groot. And the Power Stone. Um, 
Yeah, and um, for Zach, so it comes it comes with the power stone somewhere. I got I'll have I have the soul, and then next I'll have the power. One. So I hope you guys enjoyed. It took a while to set up the little stand there, but yeah, it was worth it. I think this set's really cool. I definitely recommend it. It's thirty pounds, so it's very good for its price because of the Hulk Buster. Um, this is the latest version of the Hulk Buster. Uh, which is really cool so yeah so please like subscribe and um, turn notifications bell if you want and uh, see you in the next one bye